want to start on those two? Should I be contributing right now, Should you, Why, you, you, you need to blow dry your hair. Gosh. Guys, don't zoom in on my pimple. I'm just here blow drying my hair. Oh, I was going to practice my two-step. Oh. I know, but you know, it's like under pressure. I might three-step it or something. I don't know. She's <laughs> I've known Eva for about 14 years now. She's like a sister to me. So I'm super excited that she and Bob are getting married today. It's been a long time coming for her to find someone that makes her happy and is good to her. We're here at the hotel getting our hair and makeup done. I got my hair done yesterday and we'll be getting our makeup done. So that's kind of exciting because I've never done that. And I'm not sure about these other girls, but I don't wear much makeup, so that'll be kind of cool. So just super excited for her. Can't wait for her to move on for good life experience and start having some kids. I'm in the shower and like these birds are like coming up to the window. I'm like, oh, it's a scene from like Cinderella. Like, <laughs> the birds are flying through the window with the rocks and the... Let me show you the window. And there was like birds flying up to him like, oh, tea shower. No, you're not laughing. Okay. <laughs> Give up. I did warn Yvette that, you know, obviously there are gonna be unexpected things for today and not to stress out over it because it's just the way things go on days like this. I'm super excited for her to, to be marrying Bob. They're so cute together. They, they are meant for each other. <laughs> I had a rough night. Make sure you edit out that pimple though. <laughs> Big day is here. Fairly slept because I was nervous and I was super stuffy. So I had to go to Walgreens this morning and luckily the pharmacist was so beautiful to tell me to take Sudafed and now I'm feeling so much better. But we're getting ready for hair and makeup because you know, this is not cute. So the girls are all here, mom's on her way, grandma's on her way, everyone's on their way to start getting beautiful because we have about two and a half hours and we're kind of a little close. Bob already threatened me many times not to be late. So hopefully we're not late for day, but if we are late, I promise you we really, really tried, but you know. We had to finish the bouquets. I worked on the bouquets this morning and my the grandma's and mom's corsages as well. Flowers were being a little temperamental, but luckily they worked out. So those are all ready to go, they're beautiful. cousin of the bride. We were inseparable as babies. I'm the one she tortured being younger. I was her rag doll till her sister came along. And I'm very happy that she's found the love of her life. She chose me to be in her wedding. I have done a lot to be in her wedding. I lost a lot of weight to be in her wedding and I'm very, very excited about this day and I feel like everything is trying to go crazy. We even had a power outage, but we're all here and we're still getting ready and nothing is gonna stop us today. <laughs> schedule before Mr. O'Kenwell has a heart attack. Uh, six years ago actually when we first met and now here we are six years later. Hey babe, just a little late, you know, just a little. <laughs> Don't worry, we'll start at 4.05, okay? El amor es El amor no tiene envidias, el amor no es sustancioso, no es arrogante. No se porta indecorosamente, no busca lo suyo, no se irrita, no toma en cuenta el mal recibido. No se regocija de la injusticia, sino que se alegra con la verdad. Todo lo sufre, todo lo cree, todo lo espera, todo lo soporta. El amor nunca deja de ser. 
Pero si hay dones de profecía, se acabarán. Si hay lenguas, cesarán. Si hay conocimientos, se acabarán. Who offers their prayer for blessing on this marriage? Her father does. Our Lord Jesus Christ ordained this great covenant by his presence and first miracle at a wedding in Cana of Galilee. Therefore, no one should enter this covenant lightly or thoughtlessly, but with reverence, righteousness, and holiness, sincerely considering the power and character of this covenant. In the beginning, the Creator made him male and female and said, For this reason, a man will leave his father and mother and be united to his wife and the two will become one flesh. So they are no longer two, but one. Therefore, what God has joined together, let man not separate. Mm. I brought lips. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, love you. You was late. Love you anyways, for better or for worse, right? Thank you for looking beautiful. You looked awesome, amazing. Many more adjectives to describe how great you look. I was nervous for a little bit, but you know, we walked, we were through it up there at the altar. It was nice and sweet. Glad the ceremony's over. It's time to party now. Where the shots at? It was so nerve wracking. I had, got a little teary eyed right before I walked down the aisle. I'm not gonna lie, my dad had to calm me down. But it all worked out great. Everything looked so beautiful, and I was so excited. And see Bob at the other end it was just kind of like, oh, we're here after a year, after six years actually, when we first met. But babe, I love you. And now you're stuck with me forever. Let's get this party started. Let me start this off by saying I'm, I'm thankful that uh, Bob chose me to be his best man, but uh, you know, I, I kind of helped him be the man he is. So, uh, you know, it was kind of in the bag. You know, uh, I, took him, I took him under my wing in high school, you know. I, I, helped him, I helped him learn how to talk to girls, and you know, you see his, his dancing is still, we're still working on that. Uh, Dear God, we ask that you bless our children. Bob and Yvette. Keep them safe for us, O oh Lord, and provide them with good health. Bring much joy and happiness into their lives by blessing them with many healthy and happy children. We ask these things of you, O oh Lord. Amen. Hi, everyone. So my name's Athena. Uh, I'm the sister of the bride, Yvette, and I just wanted to say how thankful I am that some God or whatever you believe in brought Bob into our life because he's really amazing. And, uh, and I'm so happy that my sister is so happy. So thank you guys for joining us tonight. Yeah, 
get a wine again. Yvette, you put that in. Oh no, oh, I don't know when I own you home. Oh no, don't take away your time. Marika never want for one idea. It's a fukala over there. It's a fukala nana. Oh, no, get let up for no. But to listen, let nana. Jesus. Amen. Toast to the uh, bride and groom here. Enjoy yourselves. Enjoy yourselves. Congratulations, Bob and Yvette. We're having so much fun. Thank you so much for the invite. We wish the best to you. Turn down the lights a little bit. Please love your wife and take her as your only soul mate. What God has put together, let no man put asunder. I'm Dr. Kenneth and Yukaibu. Uh, we are friends to uh, Bob's uh, father, Mr. Anthony Okemo. We have come all the way from um, San Diego to witness the marriage. Uh, Tony is a very valuable son of Nigeria and we all love him, very proud of him. And we are very happy to see him married today. God will bless him and his wife. In Jesus' name, amen. Bob, you are a blessing and so amazing. I'm so happy you've been brought into our lives and you're stuck with us forever. So it's amazing and I'm so excited. I'm so happy and Yvette, you're like, everything, my heart and soul. I don't know what I would do without you. I love you guys and I'm so happy. I'm so happy you guys are officially Okenwa Sanchez as one. Love you guys. Yvette and Bob, congratulations. It's great that you guys found love and happiness. That's amazing. Um, also, going back to some memories, I love when you guys came over, uh, you know, when we were little kids and we used to celebrate Christmases together. I love that. I love you guys. And I wish you guys the best in the future. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I'm out. Woo! Hey, remember when we used to beat him at Mortal Kombat? Like, they, we beat they him. Never, they never, they never. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> 
to the bride and groom, Bob and Yvette. I'm so very happy for you guys. Congratulations, Yvette. Welcome to the Okenwa family. Bob, congratulations. I can't be more happier for the both of you guys. Never would we thought Bob would get married. But hey, here you guys are. I'm just so excited for you guys to start your family, to be a part of our family, and to see the Okenwas grow. So here is to a lifetime of longevity and prosperity.